Hi guys, this is Steven from XDA Developers, also known as Sterickson on the forums. Uh, today we're going to be running through really quick on how to create a simple metamorph theme for our, our new metamorph application that is now on the market. Before we get started, I just want to say thank you to all the other developers that have helped contribute to this project. That's uh, going to be Castro, Ry Riku, I can never say that name right, he's going to kill me for that. Uh, DJ, I uh, can't say his name either, he's on the forum, he uh, is actually the thread operator for the collection of metamorphs um, that we've all grown so fond of, and um, myself. So without further ado, I also want to mention as well, we do have the donate version of the metamorph app in the market now. Uh, we'd be ever so much appreciative if you could go ahead and purchase that version for $1. Um, it would always be a step ahead in the new releases coming out, we're going to use it as kind of our... Um, beta testing application so you always be you know one step ahead of the free application and you'll be helping out a developer who uh, spends his free time doing this while his wife you know contemplates throwing out his computer and completely obliterating all of his phones so please buy me a new phone because I'm sure my other ones are going to be obliterated before too long Without further ado, what we're going to go ahead and do is use um, some images from a theme, from a themer on the XDA forums, Manup456, I'm sure a lot of y'all know him. Um, this is a theme that was actually made for the RC33 build. Specifically, what we're going to go ahead and change on our phone is this right here. We're going to add this little tab, um, tab icon right here. I really like it, and it's really quick and easy to do, and we're going to go ahead and show you. I've already downloaded the theme and I've already extracted um, the files that we need so pretty much have everything ready this actually came out of the launcher.apk it's just the regular files in the APK uh, we're going to call it man up tab that's what we're going to call our theme so you create a folder called man up tab create a new folder called launcher I'll go ahead and open that up create another folder inside of the launcher called RES. Open that up. We're going to go back to Man Up Tab. Uh, we're going to go ahead and copy these. Let's go back in here. We're going to go ahead and paste these in there. Okay, now we're going to go ahead. We're in the Man Up Tab folder. If you don't remember, that's where we're at. Gonna go ahead and create our theme file. It's gonna be a regular uh, text file in a sense, but you need to make sure you name it the same as the theme. So this is gonna be manup-tab.thm theme. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and open that. We're gonna go ahead and create it. This is gonna be for any ROM, any version. It's gonna be for the launcher.apk and it's going to be located in system app so target apk is launcher.apk target path is system slash app and go ahead and throw out a thanks to mana for letting us use this all right so we're going to go ahead and save this. We'll go ahead and close it. We're going to go ahead and zip it up. So we're going to add to archive manup.tab.zip should be the name of the theme. We're going to go ahead and push that to our phone, which I already had ready. Okay, I got it to our phone. We're going to go ahead and start up DDMS so y'all can follow along with what I'm doing. right now y'all will see that I actually have the well oops actually have the buff theme right now screenshot does some weird things sometimes there we go okay I'm gonna go ahead we're gonna go and open it up We're going to pick an existing theme. Ok, 
Okay, and, and there's our theme right there. We're going to go ahead and select it. Okay. And it already exists because I was playing around with this before. So we're going to go ahead and just replace the whole thing. Select replace. It's going to delete it. And it's going to extract it again. So now we have launcher.apk. We're going to go ahead and hit. Well, we'll go ahead and just select launcher. Okay. Now it gives us the option to apply it. And we're going to hit apply. It is now applying launcher.apk theme. It's going to take just a moment. Still waiting on it. Shouldn't take too much longer. And it's done. We're going to go ahead and hit home. You're going to get a black screen at first, but that is normal. What's happening is launch.apk is having to be deodexed. And then, there it is. The new changed application tab. And you see if you actually select it. See if I can get it to do it here. Come on. There you go. If you select it, you get that. When you open it, go ahead and open it like that. So that's pretty cool. And that's pretty much it. Just a quick rundown on how to do it. And didn't take us but about five minutes. And we have a brand new, cool looking Android loving launcher tab. Well, I hope to see you all around the forum again. And don't forget to. Like I said, purchase that donate version so you can help us out and keep us uh, working and improving this project. See you all around the forums. Bye-bye.